So right now he's gonna go choose. He's gonna go try the fake, the fake meat. Oh. Subscribe and hit that notification bell. My kids love this pantry. <laughs> this place they come literally maybe every hour, sometimes every 30 minutes. So it gets to be empty, so we need to refill. So I'm about to take them to Tasco. They usually go with me. And then we see uh, what can be. It can be stressful, so I can't wait to show you what that journey is going to be. So guys, guess where we're going? Let's go. Casco, yes, we're going to the usual Casco. So we're gonna go pick up the kids and then we head to Casco. They're gonna so. be super loud. They well, they are five and six. What do you think? No, that's true. You know, they're gonna complain, they're gonna ask for something, you know. So, mm. are you prepared? No, I am. Come on, how can you not be? Find out. Casco run, we call it family tour. We're gonna tour Casco, right? Yeah. yeah. Prepared? No. Ready? No. Come on, we're gonna go get the kids, your favorite noise. I have no idea why I came in and there's about a million people in here today. Yeah. You might be wondering like, why do you bring the kids, all of them? Why don't you leave some at home? Well, I have no babysitter. So the best way to really go shopping is to bring them all, you know? But two, easier for me to have them and know that I, they're close to me. So that's why we come shopping and I have them all. One That's the one reason, because we don't have babysitter. It's not like I have a, a second person I can say, hey, I'm gonna leave the kids behind. Could you look after them? No. So everywhere I go, I have to bring them with me. So that's why we're at Casco and it can be really stressful. But we go through, we make it. Yep. We're still, we're still in the entry. We haven't gone an inch away. Casco is like hauling cows. And Carol. You better one at home. Yep. Is my good. Yes. My girl wants to come to the court. Yeah, where are they? Can you find size? Can you find Can you find any size that fits you? You like that one? Yeah. Yeah, that's for small. That's for 40, that means for younger, younger kids. Yeah. Yes? Oh, it's frozen. That's why she's looking. Yes? You know the car with? Yeah. Why Frozen? Because it's my best movie. Oh, it's your best movie. That's why. Yeah, that way I pick it every single day. Oh, so you can wear it during the movie? Why? Like, and my jersey I always have. Really? Yeah. That's awesome. Okay. What is going on? I, I don't know. Peter. Yes. See when you go shopping with teenagers, with four kids, Ooh. literally it's like going with uh, not monkeys, but something of the salt. They like to get us some of those. Oh shoot, I forgot. Which one? You got to push. No, Wait, you, is have, there any you have. But would you guys eat them? Yes, I would. I would eat these. No, no it, we're taking one. We're taking one though. Where is the cheese? Okay, yeah, then take those. See, there's what two for each. Let me see. Two for him and two for me. Well, but what about the little ones? They're too big for the little ones. <laughs> Do is only up. make a video instead of about Anthony cooking, about you trying to cook some meat, and we try it. So it's vice versa. Okay, next time. Yes, I like the plan. Because meat is good, and I want to see if you can cook it or not. With like no help, no like uh, no recipe, you cook it straight from what you think. I might cook it the African way. You That's fine. Like okay. That's the plan then. What? Oh, we're out of Hot Pockets and ice cream. I don't think they have Hot Pockets. They don't have, they have ice cream. But yeah, we need to do that. Okay. I want to try some, the, uh, I want you to cook some meat the African way. Okay, the African way? Yeah. Okay, I'm on it. So you might be wondering like, why do we show up at Casper? Like, why do we come here? So my kids eat constantly, you know? Sometimes the place they came from, they didn't really get enough food. So, you know, uh, you know, we have to make sure that they have good, healthy food to have at all times. So for me, Casco is the best place to come and buy in bulk, you know, 
when you have two teenagers literally that eat like hogs, you know, and then you have two little ones that are snacking 24 seven, you know, Costco is the best place to go. So that's why we come here to get enough so my kids can eat at all times when they want. Was like grab any milk and I'm like, no, we need 2% milk. And he was over there grabbing like the, the, uh, that one and that one when we needed 2% and he doesn't, and he thinks that milk is milk when we need 2% milk. Yeah, but it comes, yes, it, it's, milk is milk, but it comes in different, in different, uh, it's made or pressed in different ways. Yeah, so we need 2%, 2% is the best is type. Milk. Yes, we there's 2%, one, we, there's, we 2%, to there's 2 there's 2% and then there's whole milk. What's better? 2%. Exactly. Oh, my crazy kids. Sometimes I feel embarrassed being watching what they're doing. Hey guys, we're going right, 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 right. Hey Kai, apparently only you can push her. She doesn't want me to push her. Kai, you're the type of guy that you Okay. They are yelling, they are talking, yes. So here's another reason why uh, we come to Casco and I bring my whole family. Especially the teenagers, you know, just really mentor them. Like they have an opportunity to to see how, how much it costs. You know, they might like snacks or like something. But sometimes, if they know how much it costs, it really helps them to think through. Yes, these things are not just cheap. So how we use them, how we eat them, should be really uh, important. You know, so that's the reason why I bring them with me so they can just see the cost um, of what they eat. You know, that that might help them to really think through that. Okay. You know, we got to think how we consume, but also that it costs money uh, to do anything. Sometimes our kids get to see food in the pantry, but they never really think through how much it costs, how we got it. Uh, you know, so for me to really mentor my teenagers who are 15 and 17, you know, that they're able to really learn. So it's good to come with them. So it's fun. Let's get some can of what? I can of monsters. No, you're, you're already super high on a hundred. This monster will take you to crazy super high. Can we like get some V8? V8? What's V8? No, V8's nasty. Exactly. It's just a bunch of vegetables. It's not nasty. It's good. Can we get Sunny D? It's good. It's literally called Sunny D for vitamin What about Welch juice? But no, Sunny D is healthier. This one? Sunny D is healthier. Okay, we take it. Drumsticks. Some what? Drumsticks. We're getting drumsticks? Yeah, you know. Did you ask your dad first? Oh, uh, so we're getting drumsticks, you know. Uh -huh. Totally asked him about these drumsticks. Uh -huh. So anyways. This type of chicken is like drumsticks. Hey dad, I got some drumsticks. I said let's get the small... What's wrong with you with ice cream? Yes, no, they're, they're not ice cream, cream they're drumsticks. drumsticks. But, but the dr what do they have inside? Ice and cream. Ice. But they're not ice cream, they're drumsticks. Onions. <laughs> okay, okay. See, look, Thank drumsticks. You. I see. Okay. I called them some caramel. Yes, but that's a lot of sugar, and that's a lot of ice cream. All right, it's sugar free. All right, it's <laughs> sugar free. <laughs> All right, here we go, here we go. So, so what are we getting? So I'm gonna try to get corn dogs. Corn and dog For us and the kids, cause there's a lot All of All right, them. obviously. And here we see Kai opening the door, selecting corn dogs. Which one of these packages will be selected to live? All these others will live. And this one behind his back will die. Shh. These will live yet another day. So, so let's interview you, Peter. How are you, so far, how are you feeling about everything? Stressful. And how do you feel about the kids? And how do you think everyone's, how everything's taking it? They yeah, actually doing really well. I'm surprised. And how do you feel about the 10 items we stuck in the cart? Oh, those, when we get to check out, I'm I throwing them off. Well, I'm uh, throwing Something them like away. that. I'm throwing them away. No, you're not. You love us, right? That was good. Some right, days. Peter? Some days, some days. Okay, so can we go, please? No, no, she's on. She's almost yeah, done. Yeah, we still what are we waiting for? We're waiting for uh, many, that one. How many things you guys have? All of them. Bro, those meatballs. Are so right now he's gonna go choose. He's gonna go try the fake, the fake meat. Oh. Hmm. It's really good. You know, another reason why I come with my kids is. You know, it's like an outing. It's like a family outing. Hey, we, Peter. What? I said we oh. get to 
we get to bond. What, what? You just interrupted what I was about to I'm say. I'm sorry, you can finish. Yes, I said we make trips to Casco because it's like family bonding, but also uh, time away from our house, right? For people mm -hmm. who stay in the video games all the night, all day, we get to stretch our legs in Casco, right? Mm -hmm. I didn't grow up or we didn't have the same background. So there are some foods they like that I don't know. So bringing them alongside, they really get to pick up the food they like, or they get to show me, hey, I like those snacks. I like those snacks. And that really makes it easy for me to pick up food, not for everyone, but the majority that they all enjoy, you know? As you you know, our kids come from different backgrounds. They, they've grown up from different foods, you know? Uh, so, you know, I eat a little bit more healthy, less of box food, you know, so when you, you have kids who love box food, this is a great place to bring them so they can really point to the food they like or sometimes they say, hey, mom used to cook that for, then I'm able to get it for them. Or they say, we like those cheesecake, you know, things that I don't necessarily eat, but they love. So it gives me an opportunity to really find meals that they enjoy, to find meals that they, they like. So who's there? Yes, but how did you get over there? Uh, we teleported. How did you leave me behind? We you were teleported. too slow. Where are you? But how you get? Since you, you walk, you're walking as slow as, as you're walking as slow as you go. Peter, get over here! Of course, I have to look for food we're gonna take. What do you think you're learning? Uh, not to buy whatever you want. <laughs> exactly. What else? Uh, uh, Anthony, what are you learning? How much food costs yes. and how much kids want. Yeah, exactly. So Peter, what do you plan on getting? Why do you have like three boxes in your hand? I thought we were the only one that was sneaking stuff in the cart, but then I see you doing this. Yes. This is corn flour. It's really good for you. It's healthy. Okay, so we're not gonna eat any of it. <laughs> Come on. This is good for you. Yeah. Exactly, that's the cue saying we're not gonna eat it. This is, uh, yeah, this is my favorite. You know, uh, it's Mandarin, uh, lettuce, lentils. It's really Indian. It's really good. And then quinoa and rice. This is delicious as well. So you have these, trust me, you're gonna look like me. Wow, you know what I mean. I mean, what would you like? Nutella. You like Nutella? Yeah. Which one? Which one? That one, on top. On top? Yes. Okay. Uh, will you share with your brother? Yes. Okay, let's get that. Okay, this is what we're getting. <laughs> we need to get one more, one more snack. Oh, Little day, they will eat them within a day. No M and M's. We are not buying chocolate. No, M I want something healthy. No all junk. There's no stuff. snacks. That's something healthy. Hel oh, so no, no, no. They are healthy, healthy stuff. because it is meat. They are healthy stuff. Lots of them. No, it's not for everyone. Okay, let's let's give away. Let's give away. Please, let's give away. Oh, you already have your things. Excuse me. Thank you. Sorry, sir. I've got no. wild kids. I went to the bathroom and I found this. Who's this for? Uh, that is for Kai, who, whenever he went to the bathroom, ran and grabbed it. He grabbed this? Yeah, he picked it up. So this is one thing he's getting? Yep. I'm I still haven't gotten my thing yet. I'm sure he's getting it for his girlfriend. <laughs> what girlfriend? Ah, who knows? So we passed here and the kids saw the flowers. You know, it's... It's really cool that they think of their parents and so the kids are like, can we get for mommy flowers? But on the other side, you know, we can't send them to mom. We can't see mom, you know? It's kind of sad, but at the same time to see that they think of their mom, they think of their parents, it's, it's sweet. It's a Hello Kitty stuffed animal. Stuffed animal. It was now, the only look, one that they had. I was gonna get a boy one, but they didn't have any more. And I really wanted these things and this is my only opportunity to get one. Yeah, so I'm pink. going to get it. So the pink one is the one you get it. Yeah. Oh, they, are, they have like three I others. Thought, no, I thought you should collect them all. No, I thought each one of you was gonna get like a snack. No, not a stuffed. Yeah. Spiel, this is yeah? the surprise. Hey, you mine. Your... Surprise! Oh gosh. Okay. I guess I can't say yes. Are you guys gonna get a bite? Yeah. yeah. Yes. Are you getting a bite? What are you? What do you want to eat? Uh, uh, milkshake. 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 Yeah. yeah. What do you say to that, Peter? More sugar, yes. more crazy. Right. Oh, okay. He back. said yes to milk take. Uh, so it's already at four. That means that's dinner, right? We, yeah. We, you, we're gonna have something to eat here, but it's the dinner time. I won't, I won't be cooking, but getting something to eat. Can we go to the milk Yes, we go. No, everyone put your order. Oh, no, you're back. Okay. Everyone put your order. So every time we come, we always they get their snacks. As you can tell, the chocolate sugar high, that's what they get. 
but also it helps me not to cook because they get a snack here. You know, so the reason also we like being here is bonding, you know? It's kind of neat to see them up one another. It's also nice to see them try to be there for one another and be cautious as well. So it's really nice uh, sometimes to really teach them uh, and show them, uh, you know, and they, they take care of one another. So it's a little easier. So I love the bonding. And so that's why I bring them here as well. So it's really fun. So I brought my balls to help me carry the stuff. Guess what? They're not here. They're somewhere talking to someone. So finally made it to the car. We got everything. Did we put everything in the car? Yes. Yes. No, we're not getting anything more. But we managed to put everything in the car. So it was a trip, but gosh, whew. we are not even had sugar yet. But yet we are on sugar hundreds, you know? So uh, now it's time to go home and offload. And uh, they have their, did they give their ice cream? They're right there. The milkshake. It's all they wanted, the milkshake. So hopefully we'll make it home. This one is going to make sure that all this is safe, all right? So I dropped everything and Simba said that it was safe. Things made in the house. Thank you, Simba. Good. And some on my the floor. My whole switch could fit in my pocket. And some on the floor. So why did you bring them all at once? Why could you take One trip. So you one trip, okay. One trip. One trip. Okay, not two trips. No. no. Nope. Well, you might see my kids picking up food they like in Tasco and say, why does he let him pick, you know, why does he let the kids pick up the food? Why can't he as a parent pick the food? Well, here's why. Growing up, I never had a choice when it came to meals. Sometimes it wasn't even there. And so most of my fears as a kid was, would they be a meal for us tomorrow? And also we didn't have a choice on what food we could get. I can remember we could not afford sugar. So for me to go with them and somehow look for a food that is familiar to their tastes, familiar to how they grew up, or familiar to where they come from, or familiar that brings little triggers them good memories with their parents, that is important for me to give them that safety, to give them that little clue of it's okay to be here. I can see the food I'm familiar with. I can see the food I like, but also to really let them rest. <clears throat> rather than always worrying about will there, will there be food enough but for them to be able to pick it up and then we bring it and it's in the fridge or it's in the pantry and they're able to access and that gives them really a sense of calmness. <sighs> I always put food uh, that is accessible to them that they can reach. So these are fruits so they're able to get fruits they need at any time uh, whatever they want. Uh, his water, you know that they get to have water. You know most of them they like you know to have their water or drink it anytime they want. So I make it so accessible to them. So they're able to reach it as well. You know, we have, a, I, I keep cookies as well, you know, so if they need a cookie or something to eat, you know, they can have it, you know, at all times. Also in the fridge, you know, they drink milk all the time, you know. Uh, I know it's good protein for them. It's good for their growth, you know. So we make sure that, I make sure that I have milk at all times. So there's milk here. Uh, there's more milk there, you know, just always enough. Especially my teenagers, they drink lots of milk, you know. Uh, and it's something I always want to make sure that they have. So for our kids, you know, we make sure that they have all the nutrients they want, all they need, but at the same time, uh, have that food accessible uh, to them. You know, one, you don't want to give them too much, you know, but at the same time, you don't want to keep away uh, food that they need. You know, as I said, it takes a while for them to really kind of get into the rhythm that food will be there, you know, but most of the time, as soon as they come, they're always afraid of, can I access the food? Will the food be there the next day, you know? So making it available, you know, and reachable for them is really important. So that's why I keep food or fruits here at all times so they can always reach it anytime they want. So that's how I deal with my kids, but also that's how we deal with, you know, the fear of there's no food to there's food, it's gonna be okay. Uh, and that's gonna help my kids to settle in uh, and feel at home. We're grateful for you guys who send us things. You have no idea what it means to us, right? Right. For the stuff you send us and we're grateful. So we're much. always happy to receive gifts and thank you so much. Yes, so what did you get? I got a whole bunch of cookies, Oreos, and Chips a lot of snacks and stuff. Whoa, a lot of snacks. Yeah. Well, thank you guys again. Thank you. Right. Yes, thank you, you so much to everyone.
And we, I have gummies. So Ooh. there's a gummy fun mix. Ooh. Party swirl. Whoa, party time. You also send some people, the kids. Oh, look. Yeah. Yes, look. Silly buddy. I know, the kids are gonna love it. So these are their toys. Whoa, look, for school. Ooh. So long since I played with one of these. Mm, these are for the little ones. These are for the little ones. Oh my goodness, this button was so appropriate. So oh, they have enough books. Oh, that's so cute. Inspired to be tired. I love that. <laughs> well, thank you so much. Yes, thank you. Right, thank you so much. Don't forget to like and subscribe and hit that notification bell. That way you can be notified whenever another one of our videos come out. And thank you all for being here with us on our journey. And hope you have a wonderful time. Thank bye. you. Yes, bye. 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 Can't have